The Aerospace Industrial Development Corporation has signed a pact with U.S. defense contractor Lockheed Martin to build a Taiwan maintenance center for F-16s. The two companies plan to establish a base to support Taiwan's expanding fighter jet fleets as well as F-16s in the Asia-Pacific region. The F-16, the mainstay of the Air Force, is shown getting a retrofit in this newly released video. Eight hundred technicians are making it happen through eleven upgrade processes certified by the original U.S. manufacturer. Taiwan's AIDC has also been authorized to produce twenty-three types of upgrade components. On Tuesday, AIDC inked a strategic partnership with Lockheed Martin to establish Asia Pacific's first F-16 maintenance center in Taiwan. Do you want to take to I hope that under the government's indigenous defense policy, we can localize fighter jet production and maintenance. The Air Force has 144 F-16 fighter jets that will all be upgraded to F-16Vs, although progress has fallen behind schedule. Reports say the delay is due to a shortage of F-16 technicians in the wake of government pension reform. At the signing ceremony, President Su Zhenchang said the government would conduct a thorough review on the matter. Pension reform was necessary, but if the reform caused side effects, government bodies have to conduct a comprehensive review. Retaining talent is our country's most important task. The deadline for completing the restructuring of the F-16 fleet is unchanged. The AIDC stressed that the retrofit deadline would not be postponed. As the Air Force upgrades its F-16s, it's also taking delivery of 66 new F-16Vs from the U.S. Officials say that localizing F-16 production and maintenance will help strengthen Taiwan's defense capabilities.